And with the annual Cleveland Marathon coming up soon, county officials came together today to discuss security plans for that in the wake of the Boston bombings. News Channel 5's Paul Kiska joins us now. Paul, what's new about the plan in Cleveland this year? Well, Leon and everyone, this time around, the Cuyahoga County Sheriff's Department will assign a dozen deputies to the race coming up Sunday, May 19th here in Cleveland. More than 18,000 runners are expected that day, plus another 20,000 family, friends, and volunteers. Now, in the past, Cleveland Marathon officials would hire security, including off-duty police. Now, they're still going to do that this year, but this time around, the county is also helping out with at least a dozen on-duty deputies. The county picks up the cost of that part. More police dogs, a lot more, will be brought in from around the state for race weekend as well. Officials reminding everyone there's been no threat here, but everyone should keep in mind, if you see something, say something. Rest assured, our security plan, though already quite strong, will be even more intense this year. Runner, volunteer, and spectator safety has been and will be our primary focus. Therefore, the generosity of Cuyahoga County to provide this with this additional high-level sheriffs on race weekend is very appreciated. I look forward to seeing friends and family members along the course cheering the runners. I personally will be standing at the finish line along with members of my family and I hope that reassures anyone who feels any anxiety. The Cleveland Marathon covers more than 26 miles in downtown Cleveland, going past many landmarks, including the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame.